Excuse me, mister. Excuse me, are you Seth? Who are you? I'm a friend of Mr. Wes Dickens. Uh, My name's Marston. John Marston. Goodbye, John Marston. It's been a great pleasure. I need your help, Seth. We need your help, me and Mr. Wes Dickens. Let me be frank for one second, partner. I hate people. It was people who got me in this mess in the first place. What mess? <laughs> Look at me. Look. Scrambling around, looking for maps, half insane. I ain't washed in six months. My hair falling out, my mind's going. What happened? <laughs> what happened? My partner. He stole half my map. I never would have done that to him. Never. Look at me. Who did this to you? My partner. My boy, my man. Moses Ford. I don't have the facility to tell you what I would have done for that man and what I would do to him now. Why? Because he stole half my goddamn map. And what map's that, then? The map, partner. The map that tells me where it is. Where what is, friend? I ain't telling you that. I ain't. <laughs> don't make me tell, partner. <laughs> it's mine. It's mine. All mine. Sure. And where's this Moses now? He's at Benedict Point. The law got him for exhuming. Some people, they feel differently. Not Moses. Him and me are the same. The self-same. Well... Come on, Seth. Let's go see Moses, get you your map back. Then maybe you'll help me. All right, partner. Let's go. Come on! 
on then, partner. How can you sink that low? Digging up graves and looting from the dead. Ha, hypocrites! The whole damn lot of you! Are you saying it's better to steal from the living? They're corpses! They don't care none! These people have been laid to rest! You don't know nothing! I talk to them long after they've been forgotten by every other fella! I tell them it's all right to be scared and alone. I embrace them when they're stinking and rock. I met some sick bastards in my time, Seth. But you? You're special. Folk is cold and heartless all their lives. To me, they gets warmer when they're actually cold and heartless. Surely that makes sense to even you. Not exactly, it don't. Are we really living anyway? Do you exist outside my mind? Maybe we're both having the same dream, and when we wake up, we'll die. I certainly seem to be in some kind of nightmare. What'd you say? I, I didn't say nothing. I just heard you say something. You're a crazy man. You should get that head look at Seth, I need someone who can get a wagon inside Fort Mercer. I was told you could help me, but I'm not sure you even know what day it is. I don't. I can't even tell you what year it is. I knew this was a waste of time. So, you want to go after Bill Williamson, do you? You know Bill? Oh, yes. I met Williamson and Deke and all them boys. Sometimes they call me on when they get some special job needs doing. I got a reputation as a man who do things most other fellers won't. Now, that I can believe. I reckon you can get in there, no bother. Assuming you help me find this map, that is. Come on. about this map? Nothing much. Just unimaginable riches and such like. A spark of hope that lit a rage and fire I can't put out. I thought as much. Another treasure hunter losing everything in the search for nothing. Oh, I lost it all, partner. My wife, my children, my business. Good riddance to them all. I don't eat, I don't sleep, I don't wash, and I don't care. I know. I can smell you from here. It used to be about the money, but now, I don't know who I am no more. I see myself, but it's like I'm looking at somebody else. Only it's me, you know? Maybe it's time you moved on. Whoa, there. All right, this is it. Let's stop here a moment and come up with a plan. As far as I know, Moses is being held in that shack. There's a couple of deputies keeping guard outside. Can you distract him so I can sneak in for a quick parlay with that son of a bitch? I'm sure I can think of something. Leave them away from the shack and out of sight. Somewhere out past that hill. This is one god awful assignment. I know. This place is deader than a side of bacon. Ain't seen a female worth looking at in days. Stay away from them animals. They're <laughs>
Job getting rid of them clowns. Now keep an eye out in case they come back. Moses? Oh, Moses? You got a visitor. Oh my god, Seth. They arrested me. It weren't my fault. Ah! Get the hell away from me! Get that slippery bastard! I need him alive, though! Who the hell are you? Don't trust Seth! He's sick in the mind! Son of a bitch! Why are you doing this? You son of a bitch, let me go! Just name your price. Who do you think you are, mister? We'll split it between us, just me and you. Whatever he told you, it's a lie. <laughs> Did you think I wouldn't find you, Moses? Moses, you son of a bitch! Where's my damn map? Damn you, Seth! Damn you, Seth! You've always been a twisting little freak! I ain't telling you shit! Then I'm gonna cut you uh, up, uh, piece by piece. <laughs> Till you find your tongue. Friend, this man's uh, gone crazy uh, in the sun. Uh, I suggest you take my advice and start talking. Shut up, Marston. I want to cut into a bona fide man's uh, flesh. Ain't uh, never cut into a live uh, one before. <laughs> uh, 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 odd, odd fellow's rest. It, it, it's an odd fellow's rest. Now, get away from me once and for all. Well, ain't that a damn shame. I was starting to enjoy myself. I think you gone pissed yourself, Moses. <laughs> Those deputies went and put a bounty on your head. Best we clear it now. Don't need the law on our backs. I don't have no money, but I got me a pardon letter. Here, take it. You earned it for helping me with the Moses. Uh. Come on. We can pay it off in the telegraph office. Ah! Ah! Hurry up! I need to go find that man! Howdy. Well, hello. I had enough of being hassled around here. You're in the clear now, but you be careful now. So, mister, thanks for your help. Don't worry yourself with thanks, Seth. Just help me when I come ask it. No problem, mister.
Travel safe, you know. Seth. Hey, John. Hey, partner. You what you need? Ready to help me? Not quite. Not quite ready. You see, I wasted a bunch of time looking for that last bit of map. And I got to thinking, Moses was a liar. And I imagined myself doing all kinds of unpleasant things to his corpse. <laughs> and then I realized... Realized you were sick in the head? That you needed to move on with your own limited time on Earth? No, partner. I realized Moses were no liar. The issue was Aiden O'Leary, who said he had the body. Aiden died in that flu epidemic, and the bodies weren't even buried yet. You got the body sitting in the back of that wagon behind you? Yes, sir. <laughs> You're not even going to wait until they're buried before you... <laughs> well, they don't care, do you, boys? Honest folk, off to a better place. Apart from that Aiden O'Leary fella, I never liked him. They say 
He lay with his sister. I don't like women, partner. I don't. Not since Mammy died. Seth, what are you going to do with those bodies? I'm going to take them back to a nice, quiet spot and look for the map. I need the map, partner. I need it. I think we should be getting out of here, partner. Can't wait to get my hands on these. Find some place quiet near Tumbleweed. I got a feeling the treasure's around there somewhere. We gotta go faster, partner! Stay left! No need for the people of Armadillo to see my friends back here. What did you say? I didn't say nothing. Are you talking to them? So what if I am? I feel less alone with them than in a crowd of people. The way I see it, they lost their souls, just like me. You're truly a sick man, Seth. You remind me of why I hate people. For a man who kills so much, you sure seem to have a problem with the dead. Life kills everyone in the end. <laughs> they ain't so different from you and me. Aside from them being dead and rotting, I guess they ain't. All right, Seth. Calm down. You talk to the corpses and I'll drive the wagon. Oh my! Get them damn treasure hunters! Try and outrun them, partner! Get corpses and all! Damn, nation! Get that wagon down or you'll be joining them! Back as you can, partner! I'll turn these bodies as we go! Hey, you a handsome fella. Ooh, oh, oh, a bottle of elixir. Thank you, my friend. So, I guess this is too much. You ain't gonna win this! Are you hiding something, he said? Oh, you naughty little boy! Woo! Somebody needs a new cologne! Oh, look here! I found me a few bullets! It's been a pleasure meeting you! You're stiff as poor! I just want a little look-see. Oh my, oh my, is this the quickest you can go? Who's got a kiss for sad? There's some bullets on this one. Better than a poke in the eye. Go left up here. Oh my, oh my. Will you be my friends? Christ alive! It's the map! I found the map! Looks like the treasure's in Tumbleweed! That's where I was headed! It's fate! Keep going! We're almost there! See? We're one big happy family. Mister. I reckon I'll sit here a while trying to figure this out. I'm gonna be rich. When you're done with that, get over to Fort Mercer. I need you inside that place. After I find my treasure, mister.
Oh, it's like that, is it? Huh? Not talking to Seth today? Oh, the old silent treatment. Oh, whoa. Ah, that's quite a stench. Hey, Seth. Oh. Oh. Seth, come back here. Oh, hey, partner. I was just looking for you. Looking for me? What? Over there? How you doing? I'm good. Well, uh, see you later, partner. Where you going, partner? Nowhere. <laughs> OK. Nowhere wouldn't happen to be where that thing you're looking for is kept, would it? No, sir. <laughs> no, sir. Come on, partner. OK, I was just uh, fooling. <laughs> partner, uh, you know, the thought of that treasure does funny things to me. According to the map, it's somewhere in that big abandoned house. away. Try around the back. You gotta go now! It's our last chance! We're in luck. be needing this. I had it with you bastards! What that meant to be? I'll bag you all down! Don't leave any alive! What the hell? Come on! There's only one of them! You got a problem with me! I like him better dead! Sneaky sons of bitches! 
I need it more than you now. After all these years, <laughs> it's silk sheets and Parisian whores from now on, mister. <laughs> what the goddamn hell is this? A glass eye. I'm sure whoever that belonged to treasured it very much. <laughs> Stupid liars! Those stupid chicken shit maps! Making a damn fool of me. A glass eye! It's a glass eye! Stop with the tears and help me with Williamson's gang. And you can come up with another excuse to go exhume one of your old friends. Hunting dead man's treasure ain't done me no favors. Sure. Sure. I'm ready for the living. I'll see you and Mr. West Dickens over at Fort Mercer when you gentlemen is ready. What can I say, partner? Damn. 